Today we're going to do experiment 21.1 from your practical workbook. The objective of the experiment is to investigate um, th the tests that you do for um, identifying oxidizing and reducing agents. There are two main reagents that we use for the experiment. The first one is acidified potassium manganate 7. This is the reagent you use to identify reducing agents. The second reagent is potassium iodide. Potassium iodide is used to identify oxidizing agents. In test one, you are to take iron 2 sulfate and if you can see the color is slightly, slightly yellow, very, very faint yellow. And the color of potassium manganate 7 is purple, right? So what you want to do is take note of the color change of the potassium manganate. Not the color change of this iron 2, but the color change of the potassium manganate 7. So let's add just one or two drops from the reagent bottle and see if the color uh, purple is retained. Turns out the color changes to colorless. You cannot no, you can no longer see any purple hint in the final solution. Okay. For test two, you need to mix sodium sulfide um, with acidified potassium manganate to see if sulfide iron is a reducing agent. So let us see if potassium manganate color gets decolorized or not. And as you can see, when I drop this purple solution, you no longer see the purple color. In test 3, we're going to react chlorine solution with potassium iodide solution and let us see whether chlorine is an oxidizing agent. So as you can um, clearly see in the video here, the color of potassium iodide is clear colorless. Chlorine is slightly yellow green but you cannot see that clearly here so um, when i add a few drops of potassium iodide the color of the solution turns to yellowish and the more i add the darker the yellow tinge in test four we're going to test iron three sulfate the color of iron 3 sulfate is very light brown because iron 3 is a brown color. Now, we will add potassium iodide and see how the color changes. So the more I add, the darker the brown color is. If we compare this, to the original iron 3 solution, you can clearly see the difference in the color. Okay, now we're going to test the unknown X. We're going to see if it's an oxidizing agent or a reducing agent. As we have learned before, we test for a reducing agent with the solution acidified potassium manganate 7. So let's do that first. We add just one or two drops of potassium magnate 7 and see if the color turns to colorless. Turns out, no change. Okay. The second test is X with potassium iodide. 
Potassium iodide is the reagent that you use to check for an oxidizing agent. So let's see if X is indeed an oxidizing agent. So if you can see closely, the color of X turns more yellow than before.